a storm is coming. Mankind faces ruin and despair. The world is changing, yet hope remains in the hearts of the people. We go about our daily lives never knowing the forces that can change our destinies forever. We are oblivious, ignorant like sheep to the slaughter. This night, in the year of our Lord 1047, marks the beginning of our journey together. A journey into darkness, into madness. I watch him from the shadows. Is he the one? He has come far already, but he will be tested, tested to the very limits of human endurance and beyond. This night he rides looking for the old gods, armed with an amulet that has led him here. Tonight he will begin his journey into oblivion. Well, okay, welcome to our Let's Play of, um, Castlevania. The struggle for supremacy is eternal. Oh, there's more Inevitable. people speaking over me. Okay, that was my Let's Play. Oh, yeah, oh, this is your game. Oh, okay. the natural objective of every creature on this world. Sure is. kill and die for their kind to dominate. Hell yeah. Some Except call the dying this eternal struggle equilibrium. The balance between light and darkness. Wow, okay. It's got dark pretty quick. These are dark times. Times without hope. Uh... Men of faith claim that this is a test from God to strengthen our spirit. Okay. Perhaps this is true. Perhaps it is simply a pious lie. If it is, <laughs> what? Darkness has come to engulf one's proud humanity. This comes for you. We are witnessing <laughs> the end of mankind. The dog in this. I hope I get to play as a dog. No, oh, not this kind of. Uh, I'm in this kind of red suit, aren't I? Can I move? Yeah. That girl is tiny. I know these guys got sick all the time. They had to stand out in the rain, torches, it didn't go out. Hello, I am Ezio Altatore di Firenze. You killed my family. Prepare to die. Wait. I hope this is the guy I get to play, because he's a badass. Okay, his sword's not very useful, apparently. Or is that a cross? I think it's a cross. Oop doop. Hey look, it's a, um, uh, uh, Skaven from that other game we let's played. Oh. Yeah. Oh man, this is badass. Wait, what? Maybe we don't want to be in midair for this? Maybe we do? Oh, okay! <laughs> this is more like it. This is way different than Resident Evil, where I had to shoot things and die a lot. We got about like no hit points. Another one. Huh. Okay. Like it ever set a chance. Oh. Let me just press B to continue for these things. I to throw daggers now. How cool is this? He just exploded. What? These daggers are awesome. <laughs> Oh, there's a grapple. Okay. I was like, I can interact with anything, so I just did the right trigger for that. Game hasn't told me about it yet, but 
What am I hitting him with? Killing enemies get Phoenix. Oh, okay. We get XP's as well. I don't know what this game's about, but I'm starting to like it. Combat moves. Okay, so these ones that don't have guillotine. Okay. Look at this. Can I it walking to the club? Oh, that looks so cool. <laughs> Someone's coming through here. Press the Y button for this, and where he's gonna eat me. That is a block button now. Oh. Okay. What? Ah. Oh. <laughs> Look at me, Tom. Just teleport me here. This game's weird, but I like it. Oh, okay, he's down. We got a cutscene. Is he healing? I'm trying to figure out how this works. Oh, before I get killed. Oh, I see. I was going to use that when he was like diving at me. So, like, oh, diving towards him dying. Crap. Okay, let's just stop wailing on him, huh? So that's what he does, and he's there. Oh. I think they got him. Pretty brutal, really. I'm healthy. I am Gabriel. Huh. I have traveled here seeking the Guardian of the Lake. You are from the Order? They sent you? How do I find them? Uh... He... He will find you. In the forest.
Oh no, it's a dead horse. Wait, isn't that my horse? Walked over to check on the horse. Oh no, that's dead. I follow him into the old forest, watching him from afar. He is strong indeed. The one god comes to drive out the many, but here, in this place, god's influence is thin and threadbare. The old gods still hold sway here. Few venture this far into the wood. He is disturbed by dreams, dreams that gnaw at his very soul. He will rest for the night, but rest will not come easy. The battle has left him weakened, but he knows the dream will return, and though he fears nothing on this earth, yet his nightmares sap the strength within him and leave a cold grip on his heart. Tomorrow he will use the old hunting path. Long has it been in disuse, but for now he dreams. Oh, at least you know when to press the start button. Oh, the moon. A full moon. Huh. What motivates a man to confront the challenges that most of us would run from? Uh, Condemning him to solitude. Oh. Uh, exposing him to defeat and I'd rather not do that actually. How does it Hercules from the um live action? The answer is love. Oh come on. A force so powerful that all reason becomes blind to it, blind to all things, even the truth. Don't let the lady touch you. She's evil. Look at her. She looks Lots evil. Of love can make a man desperate, desperate enough to do anything to bury the truth, to hide from its pain. Oh no. She acts. He acts the ghost lady. Uh. I think those are wolves. What do I know? I hear you seek the guardian of the lake. I will take you to him, but we must be quick. Climb onto my back. Hurry. This this isn't real. This is not real. I was not expecting this at all. What? <laughs> okay. Are those wolves riding wolves? Uh huh. I'll sort this out maybe next. No, we'll do it now. Uh, we'll do it next episode. Hold on. See you next time.